Hello with it, I'm John Carlos more Super Mario Galaxy in the last part. We did Bowser's Well the I don't know, it's like it was a Bowser mission, it's like Bowser's um Dark Dark Matter Plan or Plant. Bowser's Dark Matter Plan, I don't know. Yeah, we beat Bowser again. We got another grand star. We opened up the engine room. But this part's just gonna be really fun and <coughs> <coughs> Well, excuse me, sorry. <coughs> sorry about that. Yeah, it's gonna be more fun for me because I don't have to really worry about much. I mean, I try to get stars that I missed in this part, but I don't know where to start, so that's why we're starting with this part. So I get a good, like, feel for it first. Like, by stars we haven't got, I mean, like, the ones that, like, are from leftover observatories, like, the terrace, the fountain, the kitchen, even in the bedroom, probably. Stuff like that, yeah. Places like that. Anyway, we'll start off the part by having store time. So let's walk in the library. It's Rosalina and Lomas. Okay, I think we're on chapter 6 now, if I were to guess. Let's see if I'm right. Oh, I'm sure on chapter 7. Okay, chapter 7, the telescope. After seeing their 100th comet, a sudden thought popped into the girl's head. I wonder if my home planet is still as blue as it was. That's why she remembered her father's telescope. That, that's when she remembered us. You know, I, I'm not really good at reading, honestly, dialogue with all this air story or text. I don't know, whatever. I'm making it hard on myself. Okay, peeking into the telescope, a tiny Buddha for insight. It was smaller than a star bit. Star bit. How strange. It's, it's, it's so far away, but it feels so close. She twisted the knob of the telescope and the Buddha drew, grew until she could make out a grassy hill dotted with flowers. It seemed very familiar to her. Zooming even closer, a terrace on the hill came into view. I used to go, I used to go stargazing there when I lived on my home planet. She remembered rubbing the sleep out of her eyes as she followed her father up the hill to look at the stars. She remembered how she and her brother would sled down the hill. She remembered how she remembered having picnics with her mother and on that hill on. Dang it, she remembered having picnics with her mother on the hill on bright and windy days and I want to go home I want to go home right now the girl burst into tears and the women didn't know what to do I think we're reaching the sad part my friends finally told me about about the story if you remember even parts ago when we still read the book in those early chapters anyway I want to go home I want to go home I want to go back to my house by the hill. I want to see my mother. The girl was shouting now, her face wet with tears. This is really sad. But I want, but I know she's not there. I knew all along that she wasn't out there in the sky because, because... She's sleeping under the tree on the hill. The girl's cries echoed through the stars and hush fell over the area. Okay, I think it's just gonna get more sad. So I'm gonna have to wait till more chapters are discovered and whatnot. So yeah, it's like the library. Okay, that was a really good chapter actually. It, had, it was very interesting. And it had a lot of good stuff in it. I'm starting to understand more of those in a story by that. That's nice. Okay, so we want to start with... Let's start with the fountain. No, not the fountain. The fountain's the one in the horizon that was right there. This one's the terrace. With 58 stars. Um, I think there's, I think there's only like 120 stars in this game. We're almost 50% done with the Let's Play. Almost. And, like, it only takes half the power stars to get to the final boss. Like, when in Super Mario 64 it took 75 stars to get to the final boss. 
Unless you cheated, st unless you cheated and managed to get through the um, endless staircase by like a glitch or something. But yeah, it took it took like um, let's see, let me do my math. It took uh, fifty-five. You 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 could only um avoid t getting fifty-five stars in Super Mario 64. Fifty-five star power stars because you need seventy-five stars to get to the final boss. Um, legitimately. And yeah, if 75 plus 55 is 120. So, 75 plus 55. 45? No, I'm, I'm wrong. 45, right? Because, oh yeah, 45 plus 75 is, uh, 120. So, you can only miss uh, getting 100, or uh, 45 stars. I don't know, I'm, I don't know, I'm trampling, tri tripping over all this, but, I'm, I, I'm bad at making points. Not to, um, good egg galaxy and honey hive isn't complete because it doesn't have a crown indicating that's complete. I hate it when they go down there. Okay, yeah, um, I don't think you can do anything in the, in, in this terrace observatory yet. I mean, come on, there's nothing, there's not even question mark stars to get a good glimpse on, like, what to do. So let's go to the fountain one next. Go into the fountain, do 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 do, go into the fountain, do 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 do. Who knows, I might even have to do an engine star in this part, I don't know. This part, I won't make, we most likely not have any progress in it, unless I find something good. So now we're in the fountain observatory. Let's see here. Wow, like, um, Rolling Green Galaxy is complete, Hurry Scary Galaxy is complete, but Space Blood Junk and Battle Rock are sp surprisingly not complete, because they still don't have the crown saying they're complete. That symbol of the crown means that they're complete, the galaxy is completely done and over with. And I can't do any other stars than that, either. So let's go to the Kitchen Land, I, I bet the Kitchen might have a star. No, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, come on! I wanna just go. I don't wanna use the teleport, I'm a rebel. Sucker, huh? Try getting me up there now by teleporting me back. <laughs> yeah, okay. I made a great point there, huh? Let's go talk to Luigi. Wait. Let's talk to these guys first. We haven't talked to him in a while. The Charlotte Galaxies are on the very edges of the universe. They are worlds that defy all sense, imagination, and, and limitations. I think that's what I said. And this one says, don't I need one more green star? One other like us. So we need to get another green star. But I haven't seen one of those in a while. One green star I remember was easy. One green star I remember was a complete pain in the buttocks. Or butt. Phew, I'm in beat. You have to find the rest of the power stars. <laughs> oh, great. Good luck searching for the power stars. Thanks, bro. You're pretty cool. We just cool. One up. Nice. So yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying this part so far. We're not getting any progress done, but I should go look around so I get a good taste of what's going on. You know, I could research it, but I don't want to get rid of it. I don't want to spoil anything for me. Like, and then I want to make it way really blind then. So I guess this is a good way to do it. I forget it, sir. Did I, fi I think I may have picked this um, one up off screen, did I? Nope, it's right here. Okay. So now we have... We have 10 lives now, including 0. How nice. So let's go into the kitchen next and see what we got there. We need to find a star. A good star, too. Okay, um... There's another. Oh, that one. That green star was a pain in the butt. I remember that one. Okay, so we need we need um ghostly galaxy and then we need beach ball galaxy. I'll, I'll remember that. But first, I forgot to do this. We could have done this at the very beginning of the part after the story time of the next chapter of us in a storybook. We could have just looked at the board and like, bam, well, bam. That's another way to get to the engine room, I guess. 
I don't want to go to lunch room yet. I'm not ready for it, guys. <laughs> well, I am kind of ready for it, but again, this is this part is kind of important, so I can get a I can show you guys that I'm that like I'm having trouble with this part of the game. So sure, I'd, uh, I like to see the map. So he, we are right there in front of the map for this preview screen. There's the engine room that's new, and we've been to four other um, places. And then in the corner, I bet it's the sixth place for the sixth grand star. Because there's six grand stars overall. Unless the final Bowser is, gives off grand star. I don't know. Um, um, it's kind of blurry. So, we know we're not done in the kitchen because those Ghost of the Galaxy and then Beach Ball Galaxy are, you know, not complete. Terrace, two, two of them aren't complete either. Because it hasn't said yet. And then new ones, I think they just appear as they go on. But yeah, what's last spot we're going to do before we go back to, I guess, Beach Ball Galaxy? Because I'd rather do that than Haunted Ghost of the Galaxy. Just go to the kitchen, go to the bedroom of the and see what I'm missing there. Just to get a feel for it. So, I'll, I'll cut to the bedroom of the And it's, you know. See you there. See you guys when I get there. Ka clunk, we're d okay. Um, yeah, we're here. Okay, whatever. Ka clunk, seriously, is that the best I could come up with? Okay, so of course the Bowser's Dark Matter plant was completed. The last part. Freeze frame. Gusty Garden Galaxy, and then please tell me we're done with the Galaxy. No, we're not done with Dusty Dunes Galaxy. Ah oh, man. Okay, so we got like three of. Three galaxies that aren't complete there. So I guess the start is to go to Beach Ball Galaxy in the kitchen. I'm not doing the Green Star and Destiny Dunes Galaxy in this part. I'm not. Because I know it's just going to give me trouble. It's a bully. <laughs> that galaxy is absolute... Dare I say hell. I mean, come on. Pardon my French, but come on. I'm like 17. <laughs> I'm like 17. I am 17. Anyway. Oh, another mushroom. Oh, another one up mushroom. I'll get down my way out if I have time for another power star. I might have to do it next if all those stars just don't appear and just say they have a question mark on them, but they don't appear on the um, mission select. I mean, seriously. Like, what's the logic in that? I'm going to... I hope there's a star mission in this. There should be, because I see a silhouette of a star with a question mark in the middle of it. If you know what I mean. Yeah, what's this? Undersea Carbon. Cavern. Oh, it's been a while since I've been here. Yeah. I'm a chuckster. I, I, that's like one of my favorite lines from Super Mario Sunshine. Oh, I'm a chuckster. And every Let's Player I've seen do, do it that has done that mission. Where you have to, where you have to, where you have to rely on them chucking over the way, being at the right angle and being very precise. They they all they all do the voice. Oh, I'm language chucks there, and they all get frustrated on them too. If I ever do a Super Mario, uh, Super Mario Sunshine Gal Super Mario Sunshine Let's Play, uh, it's not anytime soon for one, and then two, I'm not really actually considering it. But if I ever do, for the off chance of do decide to do that, I'm gonna hate that mission too. And I just that out. Yeah, I'm gonna obviously hit that miss mission too, because it's so frustrating. Even if you're just a little bit off by a couple of steps, they chuck you in the wrong place, or to the wrong place. I don't need Starbucks in any coin. Come on, give me a coin. Oh yeah. I hope there's a star in here that I didn't get. Chances are. I don't know. I just don't know. Why don't we ground pound this? Oh my gosh, you jerk! Okay, it's been a while since I've done this. Okay. Maybe the question marks mean that I 
died. Maybe the question marks on the star mean that Luigi has to be safe in these places. And I just have to advance to the next freaking place. Okay, um, I think I know what to do then. But first, let me do a, get try to get this one up. No, I can't pause. I was gonna just exit the level of the galaxy. I have to do it really hard. Okay, let's try cheating the system here, getting a one up for free. <laughs> what the? F oh my gosh! Come on! I was like, I I could like breathe on it and it would see that it touched it. That's how close it was. My death counter is just going up for no reason. Okay, I guess we have to play it safe now that we're on this platform. Um, I'm going to turn to this laboratory. Yes. How long is this video? Um, it is just almost 17 minutes. Depending on, I don't know how long this green star mission for the Dusty Dune Galaxy will be. I don't even know if it's playable right now, so we'll just have to see. Let me just go check. Meet you guys when we get to the bedroom observatory. Observatory, there. There. I don't know. Okay, as you see right here, Blaster this and does have a um, green star. And I think it's playable. Let's see. Just out of curiosity. Let's see how far we get in. Let's, I'll, 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 cut, I'll cut it short if it gets too long, but we should be fine on time. Come on. Come on. Come out and fight like a man. Okay, that says, says myself. No, no, no. Okay, that showed sure killed me because you went back and said you made contact with my own. But oh well, I'll take it. Oh my god, you dick. You absolute dick. Okay, attempt number two, take two. There we go. Taking all your star bits too. Okay, here's coins if you need them. I however don't need them because I have full health. But you know. Ooh, that under that one's a um, health extension. Oh my gosh, no, I want to get the health extension. No. Oh great, this looks fun. Unless it's the same exact thing. <laughs> I hope not for the whole level. That'd suck. What? I didn't get that. At least I'm not being timed this time around. That was an absolute fail. Got it. Okay, now I'm gonna go for this bit. Start piece. Oh yeah, it's different already. Cause look at these boxes. I must say, I must say, were they fight the first time we did this? Can't remember, but I don't think they might not have been. Might, they're probably not there. Whoa! 
Oh, I thought we were going to that big tower thing. Okay. Oh yeah, these tornadoes look really familiar. Maybe it is the same mission. What a bummer. Well, we'll see. Let's keep on going forward. If not, you guys could have seen the whole game. Just got walked, took a memory down, me walked down memory lane. Oh my gosh! I didn't mean to fall in the sand. Are you kidding? I just didn't. Gosh, I was to get checkpoint right here. That's nice. I also got the one up before I died, so it's kind of neutral. Yeah, I just got it right now, so it's still neutral. Yeah, this looks awfully familiar from the first time. Not the speed up, speed, speedy comet version, but the original, like, original version. I don't want to deal with this. This doesn't look this different at all, but I could be wrong in it. We'll see. Because, like, there's a star right there, isn't it? There's a star right there. I just don't know. Why'd I do that? Okay, good. I was about to say. There's so many one-ups in this level. Oh, come on! Come on! Seriously? Like, are you kidding me? No! Are you freaking kidding me? That quicksand's deadly. Oh my god. This just is, This just bites you guys, you know? And I have only good bites. Like, you know, um, KFC chicken bites, and... I, I don't know what else that... Is in, I don't know anything else that's in the same category as bites. Love bites, hate bites, poison bites, bites on Pokemon, Pokemon that knows the moves of bite, and f fans. I don't know. I don't know. Farkle. <laughs> there we go. Farkle. Farkle works. Go down there, gravity. I'm pretty sure I'm doing this all for nothing, which I probably am, and I probably know that right now. But I still want to entertain you guys with my commentary. Even if the gameplay is already overdone or used, or. Because, you know. Yeah. I've already done this mission for you guys. Okay, we'll go over here. Um, I don't want to make any contact with you jerks. Talking, talking to tornadoes. So now we just climb up here. And then grab on this. Okay, if it's over here. Yeah, I already got that star. Yeah, I already got that star, and I was trying to go to the other place. Huh, man. I'm pretty sure I did this all for nothing now. So. Let me take a good look around. There's one up right there. Interesting. Let's go over here then. Awesome, I got another one up. Huh, interesting. Got it on top of you. And then here's another one up if I can get it, yeah. Oh man, that was so risky. I think I did this whole mission for nothing. Which is kind of upsetting actually. So I guess with that all said, um, we have to just go into the engine room. We're forced to go into the engine room, but it's optional because, you know, you're the player. So I guess the next part will start in the engine room and get more power stars there. That way we can actually get power stars in the next part. So I hope you guys enjoyed this part. I know it wasn't the most entertaining one and really didn't have much in it, but 
sometimes in a fight once play you gotta have those parts where the player or the let's player gets to relax and just have fun and explore. You know, enjoy the game without having to worry about if you're gonna beat this boss or how hard this boss is gonna be or stress or anything like that, you know, because it is a blind let's play. I I know people put a lot of hard work in their blind let's play, you know, they try their best and all, and that's what I'm doing, so yeah. So in the next part of my Super Mario Galaxy let's play, we are going to go up to the engine room and get power stars and, and to probably get two power stars of the first galaxy. So yeah, with that said, this has been Giant Crew again. I like to watching again. Goodbye and hope to see you guys in the next part of my Super Mario Galaxy. Let's play.